There's a new accusation in the death of a lacrosse woman. According to court records, the defense of Eric, ha Eric Sackett, the man who was charged with the death of his former girlfriend, Erin Sambalai, says there's actually another person who's responsible. Sackett's attorney filed a motion this week. News 8's Jordan Fremstead is in our newsroom with more on this new development. Jordan. Sambalai was first reported missing in early June of last year. Now, her body was found two weeks later in Rung Hollow Lake in Vernon County. Her former boyfriend, Eric Sackett, was charged with killing her last August, but a motion filed by his attorney says Sambalai's doctor is to blame. It has been more than a year since Lacrosse resident Aaron Sambalai was found dead in Vernon County, more than 25 miles from her Lacrosse home. Since then, her ex-boyfriend, 38-year-old Eric Sackett, was charged with first-degree intentional homicide. According to the criminal complaint, evidence found at his home, cell phone records, and a possible motive connect him to the crime. This week, Sackett's attorney filed a motion that points the finger at Sambalai's physician. According to the court record, Sambalai was hired by the doctor to take care of his son. The public motion also states the doctor had a, quote, paid sexual relationship with Sambalai. The motion says the doctor prescribed her several prescription drugs, including Adderall, which is used to treat attention deficit hyperactivity disorder. Sambalai's toxicology report showed her body had seven times the recommended dose of Adderall. The motion states the alleged motive is, quote, Miss Sambalai had confided to multiple people about the source of her extra money and the acts she performed in order to earn it, and also stated her plan to extort her doctor for additional money in exchange for her silence, end quote. The doctor was originally one of three suspects in the case, but investigations into him stopped when Sambalai's body was found. No charges have been filed against the doctor in this case. And now, just so you are aware, we are not naming the doctor because no formal charges have been filed against him. Thanks so much, Jordan. The motion is scheduled to be heard in early September. If Sackett is convicted, he faces life in prison.